Buffalo public school students will return to the classroom full time starting in September. And tonight, parents rallied to ensure that healthier food options will continue to be made available for students. Two on your side's Leanne Stuck has that story. Buffalo Public Schools announced this afternoon that all students pre-K through 12 should expect to return to full in-person learning in September. And following that announcement, parents gathered at a rally to ask the district to continue to invest in student food and nutrition. Jessica Bauer Walker is the president of the Community Health Worker Parent Association and said she's been working for the last decade to make improvements to student nutrition in the Buffalo Public School District. She said they've come a long way. Um, most of the food was highly processed and sugary that the kids were getting. And so over the course of 10 years, we've um, gotten more fresh and healthy foods and whole grain foods into the school. The kids get free breakfast and lunch. Um, the, the youth advocated for salad bars and got salad bars in all of the schools. Wednesday, she joined other parents and nutrition activists for a rally ahead of Wednesday's Board of Education meeting to spread awareness that work needs to continue a message they also shared with the board. So there's a big central food service building and that building has been under a lot of stress because they've had to, to do a lot over the years. So there needs to be some improvements structurally. There needs to be more food storage and capacity for um, from scratch cooking and fresh and healthy food. Bauer Walker also said they would like the district's wellness policy, which was implemented in 2017, to be updated. You know, I think I just want the community to know that, you know, we have kept the work of this wellness policy um, going and that, you know, we have, it's a priority. It's a priority for us. Dr. Williams said the updates could be made as soon as September. Leanne Stock, Channel 2 News.